guys do a quick walk around of the bike here 2012 road glide custom in chrome yellow uh, a few things we've done to it since we picked it up more than a few quite a bit actually starting at the front done the dirty birds concepts integrated molded windshield color matched the headlight bezel obviously pinstriping that you can see there done the flat black on the bells for the front forks led driving fog lights added the lowers with speakers in them there swapped out the turn signals for low profile so they snug up inside the fairing there coming around to the cockpit area we've got 12 inch risers from forbidden motorcycles fly racing motocross bars then the shorty two finger motocross style levers hand guards Pioneer Stereo, PRV Amplifier. There are eight speakers on here from Polk Audio. Got two in the stock locations, two down here inside the fairings, and two in the lowers, and then two in the saddlebag lids. My stereo actually links up to my phone, which can show me song, date, time, and speedometer, because looking, Obviously, my speedometer is blocked from the risers now. Down here, we took out the cigarette lighter, put in a voltage gauge, so I've got a digital and analog voltage monitoring. Tire pressure monitoring system we just installed. This side over here, I enter, installed a dual USB charging port there for cameras, helmets, whatever we need to charge. Also have a charging port inside this glove box more pinstripe upgraded spark plug wires linkage swap out upgraded charging system upgraded stator and rectifier swapped out the floorboards four inch drop extended saddlebags with skid plates underneath them and there's the lids with speakers added the tour pack Around to the back, you can see more pin striping and up under on the fender there. The LEDs on each side and the filler panels are for, uh, along with the four ways, if we're on the side of the road, I can flip those on. They're an amber white. So if we're taking pictures or anything like that, it's a little more safe. The hammock seat from Harley Davidson. Full stage one, uh, decatted head pipe. Uh, fuel tuner, air intake, and exhaust are the big Louis. It's got progressive adjustable rear suspension, progressive cartridge inserts in the front forks that have been rebuilt. 2012 Road Glide Custom, 67,000 miles, and loving every one of them. Thanks. My husband and I. Um, Robert Hennings, we all call him Bob, and my name's Robin. We live out in Ellensburg, Washington. Um, we raise Texas Longhorns just for a hobby. Um, he's a plumber. I'm a preschool teacher. But anyway, um, he decided to trade in his Harleys that he had before, and he ordered himself the 2020 Road Glide Special last fall. And he ordered it directly from the factory because... He wanted this gorgeous scorched orange and silver flux color. And that's the only way he was gonna get it if he ordered it. Um, he had the stage one kit installed with the Screaming Eagle air intake. And then he had the Reinhardt slip-on exhaust installed also. So he wanted a little bit more sound. It's always nice to be heard when you're out there on the road. Um, they should be able to see them in this color, but you know how invisible we are when we're on the bikes. Uh, he also just recently uh, ordered himself a, a clockwork sport flare windshield, so he installed that last weekend. Um, we haven't even gotten a chance to get out and get a spin on it to see how he likes it, but I'm sure he'll enjoy it. Anyway, um... He says it's, 
it was no mistake trading in his other two bikes for for this one because he he really loves it i hope you don't all laugh but this is my ride over here um it's not a two wheel but i sure love it um it's a f3 limited limited and it's uh 2018 um seems i can't get anybody to ride with me but my dog so i've got a little carrier it's a pet palace um the grand pet palace i believe and i added some little blingy um decorations like my, around my uh, license plate and then my husband bought me the uh, prisoners of war uh, flag and then I'll, of course also the u.s flag and i have a little spider there but i just love this oh i often refer to this as my dad's lawnmower because my dad had a lawnmower when i was a kid a ride on and it looked an awful lot like this i'm sure my dad would be laughing about that if he was with us and our oldest grandson is a marine so got the sticker for to represent him and then i got the sticker to represent all of you so i hope you enjoyed our our little video and i hope you all enjoy the ride we call life okay bye guys hey there ordinary asses this is mike greggle gray wolf hd on instagram and this is what I have between my legs. It's a 2017 Road Glide Special in Velocity Red Sun Glow. I am glad I was able to get a 17 as an 18 they went all black and that's okay. But for me, I'm more of a chrome person. I have the chrome front end for easier cleaning. 18 inch front and rear agitator wheels from Harley Davidson. The geometry for me works perfect. Um, in addition to, uh, I did go a little bit black as you'll see when I go through the bike up by the dash area just to break down and cut down on that reflection from the sun to start from the front i do have a freedom 12 inch windshield i also have the custom dynamics turn signals front and rear in addition to the tri bar in the back i will also be putting in up front right next to the headlight here is a place for the vent with screens and lights from custom dynamics and yes i do ride those are some bugs from today and then on the back of the bike i'm going to be putting the saddlebag lid lights coming up to look around here to give a little bit more ventilation i went with a kiriakin add-on it takes and adjusts the air in to keep me a little cooler as i mentioned before to cut down on some of that reflection I did go with more of a blacked out console area. So I have the KST spearheads, 12 inch with three point adjustment. Also with the center console, I got from a 2018 takeoff. I also have the um, Avon grips on there, as well as a rock form phone mount. Coming back, I do have the Super Touring Deluxe from Mustang, as well as the saddlebag lid covers that keep um, myself and my wife more so her feet from scuffing the top of my bags I put on the heat guards here as well this is a uh, pad from Harley that does an awesome job for long days and keeps the boys cool and my wife has one for her to help keep herself cool as well I did go with the magic back pad just because I caught it on sale um, I did on this bike add the tour pack from Harley as well as the CVO style bags. I just like the way it curves and gives you a little bit more room. I'm not one of the guys that have to have the fully extended bag. I don't like the straight across. My opinion, my preference. Also, I got bags, saddlebag guards, as well as bags for both sides. So we both have a place to put water bottles and additional gear while traveling. Some additional things for the wife. Here I put on the floorboard so that way she doesn't have to have her feet on pegs all day. Inside you can't see is the Zippers Performance Cam 468. It also has the 
power vision tuner the air cleaner and this beautiful D D two into one pipe and i ended up with 109 horsepower and 119 foot pounds of torque so she's got a little bit of giddy up moving around towards the back threw a little luggage rack in there as you can see i've got the D D two into one a little piece on each side of the opening there if you can guess what those are those are the legend revo arcs and then i have a hitch that goes to a trailer i just bought last year which is right over there it's my n-line single wheel trailer i have yet to try it out but um in the next weekend or so i will be doing that as you can tell i'm working on the garage uh getting that dialed in other than that this is my bike and this is what's between my legs take care hey everybody this is chris patrick bikes and blades chris patrick one this is my 01 road king started out it was purple and silver As you can see now it's flat black i've added lowers and a fairing with a stereo kind of cool I added the tour pack and extended saddlebags. Wife likes the tour pack a lot better than the backrest. Friend made me this. It has a Vanton Hines two into one pro pipe. It is carbureted, has a 42 millimeter carburetor. It does have cams, I cannot remember the size of cams right now. Uh, it did have a 21 inch front wheel. I changed that out, put the stock back on. I just like it better. It's got 66,000 miles on it, I believe. Just actually did the lowers this year. But this is it. Bought and paid for. Hope you liked. See ya. Oki Hopper, and this is her 2017 Dyna Street Ball. Custom Dynamics probing signals, front and rear, plug and play. She's got Moon's MC LED headlight, grips from Amazon, part to hang mirrors upside down. Manson Hines 3 inch slip ons. With 13 inch T bars. She also has highway pegs and an engine guard. And a cup holder. Also, Whiplash Company handlebar bag. She's got Lucky Speed Company's shorty levers and shorty diesel trigger levels. Also, the horn mount with the custom made hopper. Saddleman Explorer. LS seat. My number one sticker is the TBI Awareness. 
My sister Alicia is a TBI survivor since her birth. The doctors fucked it up at birth and she has several palsy in her legs, stuttering, mild retardation, S spine curvature, and now that her age is catching up with her, she has to rely on a walker now. Her nickname is Hopper, hence the road name of mine, Oki Hopper. Eighteen geezer glide. Nothing uh, all that special. That stage one kit. That's about it. Kind of like boobies. You seen one? You seen them all? Still kind of fun to play with them. Good morning everybody, or afternoon actually here in Southern California. My name is Larry Blevins. I've been a Patreon or actually a member for a while. This is a 2007 Softail Heritage Classic. I bought it about a year and a half ago. It's got some custom paint uh, and some custom floorboards, hand grips. I didn't do this, I bought it this way. I met the guy who actually had this uh, originally and did all this work to it. Really nice guy. I bought it, we had less than 7,000 miles on it. It is a 2007. It's got about 12,000 on it now in about a year and a half. I love it. Haven't really done anything to it other than ride <laughs> uh, I do just want to get uh, a cell phone charger on it eventually so I can do some navigation and stuff on it but that's that's basically my girl her name is Angel Rose and named her after my granddaughter that way she can be with me all the time I actually have my granddaughter's name tattooed on my chest so she's close to my heart all the time but that's, that's my girl. That's my angel rose. Thank you.